Hello, this is Sharif Abuzid, and in this video, I'm going to show you how you can add an image gallery just like this inside your WordPress website using a free plugin. So without any further delay, let me show you how you can do this. So to do this, we need to install a plugin called Cadence Blocks. So you can simply, this is a free plugin, you can simply install it by going to plugins and click add new. And here you need to search for Cadence Blocks. And this is the plugin that we are looking for. You simply click install now and activate the plugin to be able to use the plugin. So let me open one, one page and let me show you how you can add the image gallery inside the page. So this is one of the pages that I need to add a media gallery inside this page to show our projects. This is a, an internal design website. So to add the image gallery, you simply click the plus button here or again, you can just click the plus button here and search for image gallery or advanced gallery. And this is the advanced gallery. So just click here. And now you need to select the images. So we simply click select images. And here you need to select the images that you need to add to your image gallery. So let me choose uh, these six images. And then we can click like create a new gallery and then click insert the gallery. So these are the images that we can or we want to use as our images gallery. Here to the right side of the uh, of the screen, you'll find multiple options that you can choose from. You can make it like a masonry and also you can change this gallery to be a grid style or even a carousel. And every option will have its own different options just beside it. So for example, if you go to the uh, um, grid option, we can make the change the image ratio from here, maybe like make it 430 and increase it or decrease it to whatever you want according to your um, like. And again, you if you want to change the columns, you can change the columns from here. Maybe you need to add like four columns for the media, for the image gallery. Of, of course, if you need to make it like two, feel free to do this. Let's make this one like three. And now if you want to change or to increase the space between each image, this is called the glutter here. If you want to, to increase it, you just click here. Of course, this will downsize or decrease the size of the images. And you can just find it here. For the thumbnail, this is the images for the size. You can control it from here. Maybe you make it like medium large. If you want to change it to be full, you can make many changes under the thumbnail image size. So for the link images, you can again um, attach this each image to a certain place. But for this video, I'll just leave it like none. And for the caption settings, if you have added captions, you can enable them here. If, for example, if you maybe you can name this each image can be named for the project name or you can add like tiny details about the project. If you want to change the uh, caption uh, settings, you can change it from here. So let's go to under style and see what we can have here. Again, you can add an image filter. This is great. You can change it to be grayscale and maybe um, early bird. You can play around with these uh, um, image filters. If you want to add like border radius for the images, you can change it here. Let's add like a 20 radius from here. And as you can see, you can do multiple things for this media gallery. And remember, this is a free plugin called Cadence Blocks. So this is how easily you can create an image gallery inside your WordPress website. If you like the video, please give me a thumbs up and please consider to subscribe to the channel because I am in the middle of a challenge to create a video every single day for the next coming 100 days. Thank you so much for watching the video again and see you in the next one. Bye for now.